10 like a 21. I got one running. Driver, place your hands in the air and walk back. She's got a gun, 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 gun! Hey. Ow. Oh Ow. God. Ow. She's running. Whoop. She's getting out of the car. Ma'am, get back in that car right now. Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back for another episode of Devin Plays LSPDFR. Today we are headed out with the Port Authority Police. Uh, I do believe these are based on uh, New Orleans Port Authority Police. Um, I'll have a link for the skins down in the uh, down in the description. What up, security dude? Uh, but anyway, so uh, yeah, we're going to head out this evening. Uh, see what we can get into down here in the Port of Los Santos. Uh, probably get up into the county a little bit to help them out with some stuff too. Because there's more going on up there anyway. Um... But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, and yeah, uh, okay, we'll go I'm ahead and get started. My unit checking a trail. How fast are we going here? 11? 10 Lincoln 21. Can you check a plate? What's so, up? Bobcat, Edward Boy Ida 7557. It's loud and clear. Target is 10-4. He's about unclear, but he's just going so damn slow. Man, he hit a tree there. Oh, okay. All right, dude. You didn't have to... Yeah, that. Like, before you hit a tree and a curb and all that nonsense. 10 Lincoln 21. Show me on a stop. 10-4, copy. 10 okay. Lincoln 21. So we already know that it's valid and clear. Uh, it's a Bobcat. Ed Edward Boy Ida, 7557, valid and clear, registered to a Harris Martinez. Harris is also valid and clear, 24 years old, with a DOT approved helmet citation in the past. No big deal. Let's see what we can figure out here. We need these uniforms. They're from Sergeant Frankie. They're legit. Hey, man, what's going on? I'm Officer Devin, Port Authority Police. Do you have your ID, proof insurance, all that good stuff on you? You got your ID? So he's driving slow because he's under the influence of narcotics. Yeah. That's why. Dang. So, all right, let's check his seatbelt. He is wearing a seatbelt, though. Okay. All right, man, you know why I pulled you over today, bud? I'm not the boss. You, you know what? People keep telling me that, man, and I'm going to I'm gonna have to tell you that uh, I uh, I am. I am 100% the boss of you right now, okay? Let me let you know my body cam's recording, okay? So if you want to say stupid shit, it's going to get recorded. But by all means, say whatever you want to say. The uh, reason I pulled you over today, bud, is because uh, you're traveling quite low out of the speed limit, man. Uh, kind of blocking traffic. New car? Still getting used to your new car? Alright, dude, that's cool, that's cool, because this car's been registered you for a while, so I don't feel like you're telling me the truth here, man. Um, so where are you headed to today, bud? Just out taking care of a few things? Okay, cool. Well, here, here, here's my issue, man. I'm getting a pretty strong odor of uh, narcotics coming out of the car, man. Have you used drugs recently? You're not that fucking desperate? Okay, alright, man, That that's cool, but you do seem like you're really nervous. What's going on with you, man? Just going through some stuff right now. Okay, all right, I feel you, dude, and I'm sorry to hear that. I want you to step out of the car for me, okay? Telling a 21, start me another unit. Roger, required. Let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and step over here in front of your vehicle, man, just because I want everybody to be safe. We'll stand right here by this fence, okay? We're going to go ahead and spawn him because he is, uh, confuzzled. There we go. Who'd we get? Another Port Authority unit. Cool. All right, man. He kind of looks like Nico in this uh, in this coat here. So yeah, we're getting narcotics indicator. So look, dude. I can tell you're under the influence of narcotics, man. I can see it in your eyes. You know, you're pale. I can see your pupils are fucked up. You're sweating. You know, what's going on with you, man? You just just be 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 cool with me. All right. Have you used narcotics? Never touched drugs in your life. Okay, dude. All right. Well, in that case, then, would you, um, I mean, I'm not believing you, man. You're lying to me. Uh, do you want to take a field sobriety test? All right, but you better get your supervisor out here. All right, well, unfortunately, I'm not able to do that for you, but I do have a, par I do have a partner out here, and we will be recording it. So, all right, man, that's totally fine, dude. Uh, before we do that, however, do you have anything illegal on you want to tell me about? You might have some drugs on you. I thought you never did drugs. So you're telling me you never did drugs, but you might have some drugs on you. Okay, dude. All right, go ahead and turn around and put your hand on your back for me. At this point, I'm going to be detaining you. Don't do anything stupid. Just like that. He's running. I'm here, dude. Down on the ground, dude. Don't don't move, dude. I'm going to move around the pole, dude. I got you covered. I got you covered. Get, get your fucking hands up. Get down on your knees. 
Get down on your knees. Lay down. You got him. Alright, partner. 10 like a 21. If you got one in custody. Roger that. Suspect is 1015. Why'd you do that for me? You knew you were fucked. Did you really think I was going to believe you? Did you really think I was going to believe you that, that, that your shit... You've never done drugs. Like, you really thought I was going to buy that? You're a special kind of stupid, my man. You're a special kind of stupid, all right? Now we're gonna step right back over here where we were, okay? Because this is a safe place, and I still don't want you to get by a car, even if you lied to me and you made me run. It's all right. I got you covered. I'm gonna pat him down now. Fucking moron, man. You and your little mustache. All right, she's got a Sandy Shores ATV rental receipt to plan B pill pack and a 9x19mm SIG P226 pistol. Social security car with the same number but different name. Some blotter paper disguised as breath mint strip with five doses. She's got acid. Okay. A uh, pocket knife and a flintlock and a bottle of water. Fuck. This dude's kicking it old school and new school. All right, cool. All right, dude. Do we have a question for blotter paper? I feel like we do. Nope, we don't. That's all right, though. Uh, what's this shit? What's this blotter paper for, man? It's just dust. It ain't dust. It's fucking. I. Mm. All right, dude. Come on. What up, North Yankton? Okay. Go ahead and have a seat in the back of the car here. I need to figure out what the frequency of that uh the the stolen car event is, and turn it down because. Yeah. All right, partner. I appreciate Hello? your help, man. I'm good. You can get out of here. Search this car. See what he's got going on here. Might be a little dark. I'm looking at the recording. I hope it's not, though. Nothing in the car. Okay. Cool. 10 Lincoln 21 requesting tow truck. Alright. Well, that's pretty much it for him, man. Let's go ahead and uh, get a tow truck out here for it and all that good shit. Here comes a tow now. Let's go ahead and uh, test these narcotics here. Maybe he wasn't lying to us, man. Maybe. I mean, I guess it could be. I've, I've never heard of fentanyl being in blotter paper form, but okay. It's LSD, like I thought. So, all right, cool. And since we're here, let's go ahead and do. Uh, let's do the guns too. All right, he's got this sig and it's scratched. All right, cool. Well, let's go pretty much do it for him. We got him for small amount of acid. We got him for. Two handguns. I'm a. I'm. I'm charging for that. Uh, I'm a charging for that. Uh, that uh, flintlock. I'm gonna do it. So, all right. He got some social security cards on him. All that good stuff. He's on the wrong side of the car. Uh, whoops. I hate cubes. I would much rather have a partition than a than a cube. But anyway. I right, cool. Well, anyway, I'm gonna get him charged, and then we're gonna get back on the road. Okay. So I'm not really sure what's going on, but we have a uh, a security officer requesting assistance right back down here where we were before when we had a uh, old Martinez stopped. Get around these guys too, I guess. Should have just stayed down here, I guess. So, 10 Lincoln 21, I'm in the area. Not gonna open for me, is it? Nope. Okay, well that's not what I said, but oh well. I'm on scene. 10-4. Uh, there we go. I knew I had a button for it. Why is this guy all the fucking way over here? Let's go. Yeah, I see you, man, but let's get your suspect under control first. Hey, come here. Come here, dude. Let's walk over here by my car, okay? He seems like he's under the influence. Turn around, dude. Don't be stupid. I'm going to help you walk over here. Let's go ahead and just get him over here and see if, uh... Hey, be careful, man. Don't don't fall over. Oh, hey. Whoa. All right. Careful, dude. Careful. Okay. Why don't you, uh... You kind of make me nervous, man. Why don't you, uh... Why don't you sit down, dude? Okay? Sit right in front of my car there. Okay? Yep. Just just sit right there for me while I talk to this guard, okay? I don't do anything stupid, all right? 
Dispatch to um, 10, Lincoln, 21, check. I'm okay. Alright, let's see what the guard Roger says. Alright, the guard says... Uh, maybe. There we go. Good, you're here. I spotted this SOB lurking around a restricted area. My expert opinion says they're baked. What do you think? Okay. Are you a retired cop or something? I mean, you, you look like you could have been, you know... Chief of Sandy Shores when it was first established in 1803. Oh, anyway, my shift is almost up. Can we get him out of here so I can clock off? All right, we'll go talk to him. You can go. You can go wherever. Do whatever the fuck you want, man. All right, homie. I'm going to agree with the guy. I mean, I'm going to agree with him. He's definitely under the influence. Slurring. You know, officer, I respect you. That's nice. I appreciate that. With the shiny badge and the everything. Uh, the badge is actually embroidered, my man. But uh, I'm, I'm, I'm glad you like it. You can drop me off at home, yeah? No, dude, just stand the ground for me, okay? Alright, just stand the ground. Okay, alright. Why don't you go ahead and get up, man? Dispatch, can you run one by name and date of birth? Bruce Wayne! We have Batman. Okay, great. Guess he took a night off. Alright, he's valid and clear. Alright, man, go ahead and get up. What are you doing out here, dude? So what are you doing out here, man? You looking for a friend? Okay, we don't have any friends here, dude. This restricted area, you can't be here. It's private property. Security guards said you can't be here, so... Are you aware that you're trespassing right now? You don't want to answer any questions? Okay, all right, dude. Well, listen, dude, I, you know, just for your safety, I, I, I just need to know, man. You know, have you had anything to drink, or... Have you, have you had anything to drink today? Your wife left you? You love your wife very much? Okay, well, I'm, I'm sure you do, dude, but that doesn't really answer my question. What about any drugs? You on drugs, homie? Fuck you, pig. I ain't talking. Okay. All right. Well, you just tell me about your fucking love life woes. So, all right, dude. Why don't you go ahead and turn around and face away from me, man? I'm going to pat you down. Nope. Taser deployed. Dispatch to, um, 10. Lincoln, 21. Check up. Like how I just nonchalantly said that. Get on the ground, dude. Kneel down. Get down on the ground right now. I'm going to tase you. Again. Did you like face planting on the ground? Because I'll make you fucking do it again. Ten like a twenty-one. You can cancel that other unit. Ten Lincoln twenty-one ten four. Okay, there we go. All right, dude. Well, um, uh, high on the list of stupid things I've seen today was that. That was dumb. It did not have to go down like this. You don't want to go to jail? You should have fucking thought of that. I yeah, fucking thought of that, you moron. Thought that guard was gonna go clock out. Alright, he's got a pair of gloves, business card for Scarabino and Scarabino Adult Productions. I wonder if that's where his wife left him for. Or if maybe that's where he met his wife. I don't know. Anyway, got a Ruger SR 1911. Batman doesn't carry fucking guns. He has a mag for his gun. That's amazing. Uh, anyway. Uh, yeah, okay, cool. A used condom. Ew. Uh, a small religious holy book and a small flashlight. Okay, cool. So. He looks like he might be a scout, like a talent scout for Scarabino. He looks fucking sleazy as shit. So, all right, man, come on. Let's go over here and sit down. Have a seat, homeboy -o. Yep. Just go ahead and have a seat right in the car there. Very good. I put him on the wrong side again. Hop out. I gotta quit doing that. I gotta remember put him on the passenger side. I don't want him in there with my that a uh, fucking with my AR. Yeah. I heard. Uh, I'm pretty sure I read somewhere that a uh, port of uh, port of LA cops carry uh, HK416, which I think is pretty cool. All right, man. There we go. Enjoy the cube. Hope you're not claustrophobic. All right, let's see if he's got any kind of criminal history or anything. All right. So around this time of day, I have to adjust my lights repeatedly to make them still look good. That's why, that's why the back, uh, the back flashes are fucking blinding. But anyway, all right. Nope, not vehicle pad. Bruce Wayne, Batman. Batman's on parole. Batman's out for trafficking and drugs. 
Shocking, Batman. So he can't have a gun. So he's weapons under disability. Cool. He's going down for another felony. He's 19 and he's uh, for another felony. He's 19 anyway. So, all right, cool. We're going to trespass him, get this guy out of here, get him off to jail. And then, yeah, we got the night is young. So let's get back out there. Attention, all units. A civilian requiring assistance okay. on um, Buccaneer Way. Elderly civilian that requires assistance. Um, that's interesting. Also, there's fucking North Yankton again. I don't know what they're doing here. What's up, dude? Uh, but anyway, I had a lot of strange people who said they were lost today. Well, he didn't say he was lost. I guess our guy, our trespasser, didn't say he was lost. He just said he was looking for a friend in a restricted area. He didn't have any friends anyway, so it's not like it mattered. Out here and see if we can find this person. Somebody must have wandered into the port and got lost. 10 Lincoln 21, I'm in the area. Ten four, copy that. Yeah, they are right there. Dispatch, I'll be out with them. 10 4, 10, 23. Hello, hello. I'm Officer Devin with the Port Authority Police, ma'am. You okay? Yes, hello, Officer. That was me. I can't seem to remember where I am. Okay, where are you trying to go? I'm trying to get back home. Okay, tell me where you live and I'll drive you home or I can call you a taxi. Thank you. You're so kind. No problem. All right, uh, let's see here. Okay, just uh, hang out right here for me, okay? Does appear to be under the influence of narcotics. Lower arm has needle marks. Could be diabetic. Could be could be narcotics. Let's see where they live. Oops, I didn't get her ID. Derp derp. Ma'am, do you have do you happen to have any ID on you? Can you tell me your name? You got your ID? Okay, thank you. Yeah, thanks. Alright, so this is Yasmin Stone. Alright, Yasmin, hang out right here for me, okay? As long as she doesn't do anything stupid, this will be a good example of public service. You know, doing people a do, doing people a solid. Not all about taking people to jail. Yasmin Stone lives on Cassidy Trail. Yeah, I can't drive her out to Cassidy Trail. That's not fucking possible. So we'll call Yasmin Stone a ride here. All right. Dispatch to um ten Lincoln twenty one check up. You can cancel checks. Ten Lincoln Okay, 21, so Yasmin, that. so. I can't give you a ride home. You live pretty far out. I don't know how you got down here today. But, uh, what, I mean, what are you doing? What are you out doing? Okay, I'm not going to mind my own business, ma'am. First of all, you called me. Second of all, you are in, you, you know, you're in a restricted area and a dangerous area, too. This is the port of Los Santos. Like, there's freight moves through here every day. Like, you could get hurt, squished by a container, or get roped into doing a really long mission driving a container thingy around. Anyway, um,. Here's my other question: Is uh, uh, kind of presenting like you're under uh, un under the influence of narcotics? Have you have you used narcotics? Just do the tests and get it over with. Okay, well I don't see a need to do any tests, but ten Lincoln twenty one, can you start me a female officer? Copy that. Apparently you can't. Assistance needed in. Uh, Go ahead and get a female out here, so. Alright, if, if you would just level with me, ma'am, we, would, we wouldn't we would have any problems here. You know, I hate to harass Grandma, but, you know, at the end of the day, I ask you. Good Lord. Come on. Thank you. Fucking ridiculous. Alright. So here's how this is going to work, okay? Unless you want to tell me what's up, this officer here is going to pat you down, okay? Hello. And if you have anything illegal... Can I fucking help you? Come on, move it! Hey, you're stuck there now, stupid. This officer is going to uh, pat you down, and if we find anything illegal on you, you're going to go to jail, okay? So, with that in mind, do you have anything illegal on you would like to tell us about? You do not, okay. Alright, well this officer is going to go ahead and pat you down. No, oh my gosh, everybody's running. Grandma, don't even do it. Shit. Shots fired. Don't move. Do not fucking move. Put that gun down right now. You're going to die. 
Go down to your knees. Go down to your knees right now. Put your hands on your head. Put your hands on your head. Don't move. Do not move. I got the gun. I got the gun. I'm going to get her in custody. She's fucking lucky I had my taser out. That I was already drawing my taser when it looked like she was going to get squirrely or, or grandma would have died tonight. 10, like a 21. I've got one in custody. Hello. 10 copy that. 10 suspect in custody. Not Yay. fucking smart, ma'am. That dude in there is trying to lose his fucking... Yeah, he's losing his shit. Nobody died. It's okay. Excuse me. I'm sorry, trooper. Get up against the car. Hello. Grandma, you done pissed me off. I'll keep this asshole busy for okay, you. Okay, I mean, apparently the trooper decided he wants to touch old ladies, so... Alright. There's two women standing right here, trooper. Okay. She has several small pebbles, a meteorite wrapper, a tits and balls, or a small religious holy book, and a bag containing a few 10, milli 10 milligram r Ritalin pills. You need to take a damn Ritalin so you don't fucking act stupid, man. What the fuck, lady? Alright. Well, so she doesn't have anything illegal on her from that Ritalin. Uh, aside from that Ritalin, doesn't explain the needle marks we saw on her. Do you have a prescription for this shit? Screw you. Okay. Alright, Grandma. That's cool. All right, well, we're done with you. All right, well, I'm going to get her charged. And holy fucking shit, that was crazy. So, all right, we'll get her charged. We'll get her off to jail, and then we'll, uh, we'll get back on patrol. I need some backup here. Units respond, code 3. Two, oh, one, Roger that. Run I think I know how to get up there. Dispatch, we got a visual on the perp in pursuit. Come on, Dominator. Get the hell out of the way, dude. I think if we go up here, we can cut across through, like, right back here, I want to say. Yep. And then get up on the bridge this way. There we go. Yeah, I didn't expect this, did you? Better stop, dude. Come on, dude. Get. Oh yeah. Oh ho. Oh ho. Oh, 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 I'm so glad I didn't tase this guy. Holy shit. Better stop, dude. Dude, you better. St yeah, dude. He's gonna kill you if you don't stop, dude. Give it up. Give it up, man. Do you want to get punched in the back of the head again? I got him covered, man. If you wanna. I got him covered. If you wanna move up. I got you, man. Okay, I got him. I got him. Cover me. Cover me. Don't move, dude. Do not move, dude. You're gonna get punched in the back of the head again. You got... This dude got straight donkey punched. <laughs> Dead like a 21. We've got one in custody. Dispatch is sitting here like, Why are you laughing? What's funny? Oh, Dispatch, you don't even know. Alright, man. Come on. Stay right here for me. Whoa, no, 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 you'll fall. Okay. I'm going to throw him off the bridge yet. All right. All right, dude. What are you running from that officer for, man? What were you doing that for? Oops. Uh, yeah, why did you? What were you running from him for, man? Can we just skip this part take me to jail? Okay, homie. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. You can't afford one to be appointed to by the state of San Andreas to understand your rights. Sure, whatever. All right, dude. Bye. Go ahead and patch it down. I no need to talk. I got you. I feel very short right now. It's like me in real life. Alright, so he's got uh, an Ego Chase Energy Bar, an appointment reminder card for Isaiah Friedlander. Maybe you should go to your shrink, dude. A cigar, a can of cherry snuff, a Tech 9 with a scratch show number, a Glock 17, a set of keys, and a purple rabbit branded baggie containing less than 3 grams of tan powder. Alright, this is Matthew Warwick. War Warwick. Okay. So he's got a gun. He's got two guns. And a, uh, he's got two guns and a, um, a, uh, bleh, and some tan powder. There we go. And I put him on the wrong side again. Damn it. I forgot. Get out of the car, homie. Keep doing that. This is the kind of guy that would try to fuck with that rifle, too. Okay. Alright, man, have a seat. I hate, I, I hate cars like this. Just give me a fucking partition. There are good and valid reasons for partitions. So, alright, cool. 
Well, what we're gonna do, and we're gonna try to pull up here, probably up here into this, the middle area here, so we can get traffic moving again. And then we'll sit right here with uh, with our back. Uh, okay. All right, that'll work. Okay. So our our cruise lights are just our rear lights. That's interesting. All right, whatever. Anyway, we'll go ahead and let traffic get moving here. There we go. And then let's see what he has on him. It's about and clear. He's on probation. That's why he's running. He's on probation for manufacturing of firearms. So, all right. That's why he ran. That makes sense. He's got that Tech Nine with that scratch serial number too. All right, I'm following it. I'm starting to get a. I'm start. I'm starting to get the story here. All right. So let's see what it is. Let's just get this out of the way. Let's see if it's just some hash. Nope. All right. Cool. Is it heroin? We've had a lot of heroin lately, so. Yep. Heroin. All right. So he's got a. Uh, he got three grams of heroin. Not bad. I'll go ahead and charge this guy real quick. This one won't be much. So what we're going to do is, and this is how I've decided to handle probation and, uh, and parole violations, is he, what is it, manufacturing of firearms? It's a federal offense. So the first thing we're going to do is charge him with manufacturing of firearms to simulate him dealing with the rest of his probation. Uh, I just got to find it. It's not entirely in alphabetical order. Some of it is, some of it's not. Manufacturing of firearms. There we go. All right, cool. And then we'll be charging him today with... Um, I don't know what that officer had him detained for. So I'm just going to charge him with... Uh, missed him. You know what? I'm just going to charge him with felony escape. Fuck it. The prosecutor don't like it. He can fix it. There we go. Felony five escape. Uh, then we got him for the heroin. That would be... Uh, felony three. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yep, five to nine grams. Well, actually, no. It was three grams. Okay, looks like I have this uh, mislabeled here, so it should be okay. We're gonna we're we're gonna go with that anyway, though, because oh no, there it is, one to four grams. There we go. Uh, then um, what else? Uh, he had a gun. Doop do. So well, he's weapons under disability because of the federal charge. So weapons under disability. Uh, probably also carrying a concealed weapon. Probably also, um, possession of, uh, criminal tools and possession of destructive, well, destructive devices. Uh, for it being, um, for it being automatic. Defaced firearm. Uh, a second charge of carrying a concealed weapon. Which, I'm hoping that there was a suggestion thrown out in Bejo's Discord to allow you to do multiple charges of something. I'm hoping Bejo takes that because this is a good workaround, but this is a pain in the ass. So, and there we go. Carrying a concealed firearm. And I think that's it. Um, yeah, I think that's it. So, let's go ahead and charge him with all that. There we go. All right, cool. Well, we'll get him transported out of here, and I think we've got time for one more. So, that's what I think we'll do. We have citizens reporting a possible okay. stolen vehicle. Recently stolen vehicle. Get turned around here. It's a Land Stalker 41 Sam Union Sam 045. So 41 Sis 045. What color is it? Doesn't say. Alright, let's go see if we can find this Land Stalker. There's a Land Stalker right there. We have a criminal resisting And he's on us. It put us in a pursuit, it did. Ten like a twenty-one. I've got one refusing to stop. Requesting air support. All right, we are eastbound on hangar. Eastbound on hangar. Continuing eastbound on hangar, crossing Orchard da or Orchard Dale. There we go. All right, we are now we're at north, northbound on Shambles. Northbound on Shambles. All right, he just wrecked. He is continuing. He is continuing. Still northbound Shambles. He is still okay. He's trying. Okay, he's back into one of the properties back here now. We're still. We're. We are now southbound. We are now southbound. We're back on one of the properties. We're headed towards the Elysian Fields Freeway. We're going to be getting on Elysian Fields Freeway. 
We are, we are cross country right now, headed towards Elysian Fields Freeway. Thanks for stopping, dude. Okay, you're doing a U-turn now. Doing a U-turn now. We are... Whoa, watch out, buddy. We are eastbound on 20. Eastbound on 20. All right. We are now northbound. Northbound on 20. Northbound on 20. Coming into Elboro Heights. 10 Lincoln 21. Start me other units for the chase. Dispatch to, um, 10 Lincoln 21. Check up. Roger, on, um, Those bikes might actually be good. I didn't mean to do that, but it'll work. I was just hoping. Nope, they were bad. He spiked the uh, the entrance, which would have been smart if we weren't already on the highway. We are continuing northbound. Continuing northbound. There we go. So really, I don't know if I would actually consider this northbound or not. But anyway, we are continuing. Try to get some more units involved. Cancel checks. Speeds have moderated a bit. We're now going highway speeds. Nothing like an early morning chase on the Los Santos Freeway to get your blood pumping. Continuing northbound, or westbound, we are now on I-2. That Mini Cooper was just humping the fuck out of that pillar back there. We're coming into downtown now. Got plenty of units involved behind us. The helicopter's keeping pace with us, too. That's good. Speeds are high. 10 like a 21 requesting spike strips. Not sure what's going on with that motion blur there. Nope, he avoided the spikes. Good try, Los Santos. Oh god! Well, we're te we're technically out of the chase. What fun is that? All right, we are now in the Del Perro Tunnel. I think I looked down to look at something else, looked back up, and there was a car just parked in front of me there. All right, he just wrecked into another one. We are continuing on, however. We are northbound on two. Continuing northbound on two. 10 Lincoln 21 requesting spike strips. You might be able to get some good spikes here if they don't do something stupid. Okay, nope. Is he turning? Nope. We may be turning. We may be turning onto Bay City Incline. Yes, we are turning. We are right, right, right onto. Nope. U turn, U turn. We are headed the other way. Okay, we are now southbound. Southbound on I-2. Southbound on I-2. Try, try to tap him out there. All right, and he's... All right, he's done. He's done. Get out of that car. I will fucking shoot you. Get out of that car right now. Get out of the car right now. I will open fire. Don't run. Do not run. Get down on your knees right now. Get down on your knees right now. 10 like a 21. One at gunpoint. On, Don't move. Um, Del Perro Freeway. Ten like a twenty-one. I've got hey, one in custody. Hello. Roger, okay. Oh yeah, she's definitely drunk. Del Perro Freeway. She told the she tore the absolute shit out of this car. Jesus, who the hell is this? Did I change cars? Oh, that's fucking La Mesa! Holy shit, it's La Mesa! La Mesa fucking chased them all the way across the city with me! What is up, homies? <laughs> love you guys! Oh, man. Oh, oh, uh, you fucking love to see it. Alright, let's go ahead and just stop traffic. Alright. Anyway, thanks for hanging out with her, homie. Lady? The fuck is wrong with you? Why did you run from us? You wasn't fucking running. You ran all the way across the city, dude. I lit you up all the way back on Elysian Island, and we're in fucking Del Perro.
Like, we're actually, we're in Pacific Bluffs. What the hell is wrong with you? Do you not realize that, you know, what, what, what you do has consequences? This fucking, I fucking suck, man. This shit sucks ass. It does. You could have fucking killed somebody, lady. How much have you had to drink? Please, sir, be considered. I'm a good citizen. You're not a good... I am a good citizen, she says. The condition of this stolen land stalker and, 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 and these cruisers say otherwise. How much have you had to drink? Hurricanes, baby, they'll rock you. Yeah, they will. You're about to get rocked like a fucking hurricane. 10 Lincoln 21, you can clear the channel. Alright, uh, let me see something here real quick. Alright, yeah, we can go ahead and just pat her down here. Go ahead, turn around, face away from me. There's plenty of body cams and cruiser cams here to see this. Alright, so she's got a suspected meth pipe. Of course she fucking does. Uh, upon a jewelry receipt, uh, a roll of non-sequential $20 bills amounting over $3,000, a pocket knife, a ULSA student ID card, and another person's name. This is Andrea Hernandez. Alright, Andrea. You want to talk to me about this meth pipe? You know, you know what? I don't even want to talk to you. I really don't. Fuck it. I don't care. Come on. Put her in our car. Yeah, I guess we'll put her in our car. Yeah, I didn't even recognize the La Mesa cars at first. I was like, who the fuck is that? And then I was like, that's La Mesa PD all the way out here in Del Perro. Amazing. Okay. I remember I remembered this time. Alright, have a seat. Holy shit. Alright. Get the plate number. And then let's search the vehicle here. Hello. This chick is crazy. Alright, so just a six pack of Cervezo Baracho or a Cervezo Baracho beer and a pair of gloves. Okay. If you guys want to head back into your town, I appreciate you. Thanks so much for coming. Ten Ling and Twenty One requesting tow truck. Tow truck. All right. Required. The tow started out here for it. Before the tow gets here, I want to run it. Well, we know it's not, it doesn't belong to her. It is reported stolen. It belongs to Leonardo McCullen. Leonardo does not have a fucking warrant for one. 17. You stole a car from a 17 year old. What the fuck, dude? You're a piece of shit. I'm a good citizen, she says. 39 years old. So I wonder if, and let's ask her this. Got to pull up here. So, okay, so. <laughs> Question for you. Okay, so let me just tell you right now that you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can it will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can't afford one, to be appointed to by the state of San Andreas. You understand your rights? The only reason I'm Mirandizing is going to ask her some questions. All right, of course you do. Great. So, uh, I mean, do you know the guy? Do you know the guy who who, who owns this car? I just threw up in my car. I gotta go home. You don't want to answer your questions. Okay. All right. all right. Totally fine. I think she does, but oh well, it doesn't really matter. So, all right. Uh, let's check that meth pipe. I don't think we can actually check the meth pipe for anything here. Because I think I haven't gone in yet and changed it to have powder or anything. Whoops. What did I just do? No, oh, okay. All right, so we don't have anything. We don't have any guns either. All right, cool. No big deal. So, all right, well, that's going to pretty much do it for this episode. I'm going to get I'm gonna get Miss Hernandez charged here. And then we're gonna we're gonna get back on the road, or actually we're gonna do the court thing. I lied. All right. Well, that was eventful, uh, and we definitely have a few people we want to do the court thing with. So let's go ahead and do that now. Uh, this is uh, Miss Hernandez. Unfortunately, the game crashed like right after I finished recording, which is good because I finished, but I had to load back in and get another pad to charge her with. But we're gonna start with uh, Harris Martinez who we uh, ended up pulling over uh, initially uh, for driving slow. Um, Turned out that he was, I mean, just going to tell him to speed up or, you know, get off the road, but turned out he was under the influence of narcotics. Uh, so we ended up giving him uh, OVI first defense, weapons while intoxicated, as he had a flint lock and another weapon on him. Uh, P226, I think. Uh, had some, had like five hits of acid on him, so missed me, or felony five for that. Uh, possession of a face firearm, his, uh, his SIG was scratched, I do believe. Uh, it, um, a social security card or something on it that had his number but a different name so fraudulent social security card there uh and then two carry concealed weapon for the flint lock in the in the 226 uh he's gonna get a three-month license suspension in addition to two years and nine months in prison for uh for all that all for driving slow 
Like that's that's the thing. Like sometimes the stupidest traffic infractions lead to to arrests. So, all right, Batman uh, was trespassing out at the um, out at the uh, the docks. Security stopped him. Uh, we charged him. We ended up charging him with criminal trespassing, which is really the least of his worries because we also charged him with uh, trafficking in drugs. Now that was what he had that prior and was also on parole. So I'm assuming that's what it was for. Um, so we charged him with that, so he's going to finish whatever sentence he would have had for that, since he's violating his parole. 19 years old, already has this problem. Carried a concealed weapon, can't even have a gun anyway. He had a gun on him. Um, weapons while intoxicated, fine. Weapons while under disability for having a federal charge and also carrying a gun. Can't can't do that. Uh, and then, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Um, obstruction, because he tried to run from us. So, uh, Yeah, that's going to be 13 years and 4 months. So yeah, he's, uh, he's going to... He's gonna finish up his. Uh, he's gonna finish up his time. Looks like they cut him a deal. He got eight years off of uh, off of what could have been uh, that. Actually, they gave him the maximum, so they must have suspended the sentence, or he must have time served, or something. But anyway, yeah, he's gonna be in for. Uh, he's gonna be in for a minute. He's spending thirteen years of his life in prison at nineteen. So he'll be out. What he'll be like thirty two when he gets out, something like that. So great. Yasmin, uh, grandma who tried to kill us. This is what happens when you try to be nice to people. I was just going to get her a fucking ride out of there, but then she decided she wanted to try to fucking kill us. She pulled out a gun. She discharged shots. I charged her with two felonious assaults, one for myself, one for my partner, uh, one attempted murder, uh, aggravated possession of drugs for the uh, the Ritalin she had on her. Uh, it's a felony five. Carrying a steel weapon, I'm discharging a firearm at a peace officer. She's doing life. I mean, what's left of it uh, is going to be spent in prison. So, uh, yeah, cool. Uh, works for me. Uh, Matthias worked. We ended up charging that. That was a dude who was running from that cop up on the Elysian Fields Bridge. I've been charging him with felony escape. Uh, he had uh, some heroin on him. Uh, he had a Tech Nine on him with a scratch serial number. So uh, possession for face firearm, possession of destructive devices because it was automatic. Uh, carrying a concealed weapon, weapons under disability because he also had uh, and he had a he had a manufacturing firearms felony charge. So that's um where that came from because uh, he was also on probation. So there we go. Uh, he's doing 14 years on that. Uh, that works fine for me. And finally, we have Miss Gomez, uh, knee Hernandez, not the right use of that word, but that's what I'm going to use it for. Uh, vehicular assault. I don't remember if she fucking hit anybody or not, but I feel like she did. Uh, grand theft of motor vehicle because that vehicle was stolen. Failure to comply because she didn't stop when we six, when the six, when they signaled her and she led us on a chase all the way across the fucking world. Uh, possession of drug abuse instruments for her, for her meth pipe, receiving stolen property. For the ID, she had the ULSA ID, and then possession of criminal tools might not stick. Uh, I'm gonna go with the money because uh, she was gonna buy dope. That's my that's that's my thought there. And apparently they bore me out on it, but she was found not guilty of the grand theft, so maybe she did know that guy and he recanted the charges. And then also possession of drug abuse instruments turned out it wasn't a meth pipe, I guess. But whatever, she's still doing five years uh, for the failure to comply. Uh, it's a 102 month license suspension. Uh, but yeah, three years for that, another year and a half for the vehicular assault, and another year for the criminal tools, so. Alright, cool. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed this episode of Devin Plays LSPDFR with the, uh, Los Angeles Port Authority Police based on the New Orleans Police, like I said, or New Orleans Port Police. Um, yeah, pretty cool car, great uniforms from Frankie, you guys should definitely check out his Discord, uh, he makes great stuff. Cost you a little bit of money, but it's worth it. So, alright, cool. Well, uh, as always, I hope you all stay safe out there, okay? No, what's up?